All right, so for the next method, I'm gonna be trying uh, the impact gun hasn't worked for removing this crankshaft pulley bolt. So I'm gonna be taking my tow rope and actually um, putting it on here. I have the crankshaft supported with the crankshaft tool supported against the the CV axle right there. And I'm gonna go ahead and hook up my tow rope and see if I can just pull this to get it to break loose. And I'll let y'all know how that goes. So here we go. So I have it hooked up right there like that, and I have it hooked to the vehicle right there. I'm gonna also put a brick at the back wheel to make sure the vehicle doesn't roll forward. All right, so here we go. So I'm just checking on everything right now to make sure everything's still straight before I put a whole lot of pressure on the rope. I already have a little bit, but not nothing serious.
All right, so I let the pressure back off of the rope, and now we're gonna put the impact back on it and see if that got it to break loose. And just like that, guys, that that seems to be the best method. Um, seems like to be the best method that I found so far to get that bow to loose. Um, a few of the other methods that I tried was. I thought I had them recorded, but it looked like my camera had turned off. Um, I had tried to take a bar down here and just pull on it as hard as I could. That didn't work. I also uh, used my impact on the highest setting. That didn't work. And I also tried the method of bumping starter. That method didn't work either. This was the only method that actually worked on this vehicle. So now, we're gonna go ahead and move on with the rest of the process for uh, taking loose this timing belt. So here we go.